All right, in this video, we're gonna get this boat ready to take out onto the water. I'm gonna clean these blinds off and I'm gonna put on a skag guard. So I'm gonna do that first. I'm gonna put this on. Uh, what happened? Forgot to lift the leg and took the boat that much off. So I'm just gonna cut some of this off and um, then I'm gonna tap on the skag guard. I'm gonna clean the splines off, put some grease on there. There's Big Winnie. If you guys wouldn't mind going down there, hitting that like and subscribe button. Okay, <clears throat> I got our metal bit on. As you can see, gums it up pretty good. So I really probably didn't need to cut this off, but just wanted to get a nice edge to slip that skag guard on there. <sighs> There's our piece. Nice, uh, nice edge. There's a little curve that's okay because that's what we're putting on there open this up and put it on see if i need a knife or not nope We've got some allen keys with it we're gonna have to mark some holes so now we'll just fit it probably gonna need a hammer tap it into place get a block of wood and uh just tap it up. Okay, those aren't scratches, it's just a flexion. So I'm pretty happy with where that's sitting. What could possibly go wrong? Sure hope it's right. hardware and my and some allen keys so go ahead and put those in zoom in for you guys and I got uh, these are the two props I'm gonna try out. So I got this one. It's um, tuning point. Um, they say it's a uh, aluminum. Acts like a stainless four blade. Two of the props are rounded for their bow lift. Two of them kind of a sharper edge on the back uh, to get you up and out of the water for towing. I went with this one uh, just to try it out. It's way cheaper to get a aluminum to just try it. And this is a 17 pitch, 14 and a half. And this one over here is uh, kind of what the boat calls for. This is a pretty fast prop. It's a 21 pitch uh, mercury. So we'll put it on there just for the bling. It can spread some of this grease around. Made sure there's a spacer in there. Made sure that was in there so that the prop doesn't uh, hit or anything. And then you have these two pieces. You got your lock washer and your nut. 
And this goes on. That goes in. I got those tabs bent over, which uh, I'll probably have to bend them out so that I can tighten this up. That is a inch and one sixteenth. You need your block of wood, put it in there. Okay, now we got those torqued. And you just take your tabs, bend them in. That looks pretty good. So there it is, skag guard complete. Now in the next video, if you wanna watch, uh, I'm gonna take it out to the lake and we're gonna test the difference between the two props.